Yeah, we all say that uh, we've been told that in America, you know, things are great, right? That's like kind of like how I feel when I see a billboard that says Coors Light is refreshing. <laughs> it's not the word I'd attribute to chill donkey piss. <laughs> but I like IPA, so I'm bitter. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, so, yeah, uh, what made America great? Apparently the Cold War. We're talking about building walls and shit. It's like, dog, why are you stalling? <laughs> it's funny, too, that, you know, all these people, they're basically being moved because of crazy, you know, neo-colonialist shit, that they're coming all the way up here, and then we got to say that they're lazy, but they come up here for a job. That's pretty wild. I mean, I guess they're just land scapegoats. Yeah, uh, trying to find the truth in the media and the government's just crazy. It's like it's, they tell us that we can't handle our shit, but then they're just legislating us laxatives all the time. Uh, <laughs> it's like trying to find the uh, trying to find the truth in the media is like trying to find a kid at John Wayne Gacy's house. You got to dig for it. <laughs> George Bush. I think he's one of the most underrated actors of all time because, you know, we've been told that, uh, you know, we're fighting this war on terror and shit. Does anybody know where George Bush is from? Texas! No, he's from fucking Connecticut. So when he said he's fighting a war on terror, he should have said, we're going to knock it out the pack. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying, the point is, is that what we're told is shakier, the foundation shakier than the handshake of Michael J. Fox. Oh, Some of y'all get that fair shake. <laughs> yeah, we're told we're fighting for freedom. What freedom? Our freedom's some more shit on that German porn star. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, but yeah, so we're fighting a war on terror. We say we're bringing these countries democracy. Yeah, they say that you know, the U.S. government has a blank check to do whatever it wants around the world. I don't think that's true. I think it's more of a coupon. <laughs> And apparently democracy is like a synonym for bombing the shit out of people. It's going to be democracy, but I guess they're stumped. I feel bad, you know, it's my impersonation of an Iraqi kid. Look, Ma, no hands. Yeah, I feel bad for the Muslim women because I actually identify with some of their philosophy. Uh, they don't eat pig, which means they'll never suck a cop's dick. <laughs> And yeah, if you, if you don't want to fight in these wars, you know, and they bring back the draft or something, there are some, you know, backdoor options right here. You know, Trump says he doesn't want gays in the military. So you can just say, I like to suck dick, and I'll be playing your Trump card. 